Hi. I'm going to do something. Option system. Is it a five currently? I'm going to turn off the music so I can appreciate the sound of these flies. Truthfully, not as dramatic as I thought. They were really blending in before, I felt, with the, um... Hmm, this is interesting. With the chorus and the music. But maybe it's not as dramatic as I thought. Still can't ride my horse. If I could ride my horse, I just feel that I could jump up onto this thing. Um, so I'm very fascinated by this creature's design. It definitely heavily resembles the face in the bottom of Stormvale. But I feel that it also somewhat resembles the ruffly face on Rykard. And it definitely has parts that resemble basilisks, although I suspect those could be... It could be that basilis basilisks are just the advanced form of the sort of plant-like structure that grows out of death blight, which is so interesting. Um, the strangest part of this design, though, is this fish-like tail, which I don't really feel like I've seen... Well, no, that's not true, is it? Basilisks do have a sort of fish-like tail. Is it scaled like that? And then there's this cloth, which is actually maybe the weirdest part. I suppose it's somebody who was once a god and then was stricken with death blight, becoming so death blighty that they been for so long that they grew into this massive form, um, sprouting not just the branches but the eyes and the tails and whatnot that are associated with death blight via, via the basilisks. Um, and this may just be the tattered clothing that it was wearing. For a second, I thought that it resembled... What was it? Was it a talisman? Yeah, this. But I think that's not true. Oh, man. Is the Black Knife assassination like the same thing that killed the first god of the dead? Like, like sorry, the first dead of the gods? Um, or nah? This is the same entrance I've come through before, right? Yes, I think so. Uh, I want to get a peek For a moment, if I may. Oh wait, what did I get? Oh, forty thousand. Hold on a moment. Before I risk anything, I have these Newman's runes. I think it will take two of those, actually. Hopefully that's enough. Close. Probably could have just killed one of those guys, but whatever, same difference. making that crunching sound. Um, Alright, 20 vigor, 20 endurance, 35 mind, 35 intelligence, 20 dexterity, 18 strength, 28 arcane. Maybe I should just get this to 30.
Well, don't jump down. That kind of defeats the whole point of why I was killing it. Why are you disappearing? No, oh, come on. Really? Ah, dingus. Fine. Okay, no, that is not a very fish-like thing. And it also occurs to me that although... Hmm, these appear to be overgrown with actual plants. There's a possibility that these guys are actually just some other creature that is also, because it's afflicted with death blight, has these features, rather than death blight being made of basilisks could be, you know. Oh, right, and I forgot. That is kind of the case, isn't it? Because its true eyes are tiny and next to the mouth. And the thing sprouting out of the head, these giant eyes, that that might just be death blight in this war in this particular game's lore. So Yeah, I don't know. I get the vibe that maybe the fishtail is something that Fish tail might be something that the uh, the god up there already had. So this is interesting. Um, oh, well, that's not what I wanted. This thing's huge. I didn't like the fighting with it. It didn't feel good. Didn't I get something? Yes, I did. I did get something. And I decided to wait to read it because... I wasn't sure if my mic was recording. But now it's been a while because I stopped to write. What was it? I'm going to have to check that. Um, it was called Fia's something. Fia's... Um, it drops Fia's mist, which is a what? It's a sorcery. Probably faith-based, judging by everything else that's going on in here. Uh, faith-based sorceries, blah, blah. 
yes. Ah, uh, yes, it was what he was using. The annoying guy, Lionel. Sorcery of Thea, the deathbed companion, creates a deathly mist before the caster, which inflicts death blight upon those who enter. This sorcery can be cast while in motion, charging enhances range of the mist. This sorcery was developed to oppose the round table hold and is effective only against the tarnished. All right, very well. Um, where was that really cool looking super gnarly knife? That's another thing that I was interested in. Um, just kind of giving other weapons a little bit of a chance, you know? Uh, was it this? No. Um, was it a great sword? That would be weird. Hmm. It wasn't this, although this is a badass weapon. Hmm. What am I thinking of? It's like a long knife. But it's not a sword, it's a knife. No. 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 Ah. This. Surely that inflicts some sort of bleed, right? But I didn't say it did. Okay, so I'm in an interesting position here where the two ways I have forward are um, one, teleporty teleporty over there, and two, teleporty through the coffin down there. Both of which kind of take me away from what I wanted to do, which was find a way to get the item I missed at the beginning. So I'm going to go back there and just see if I miss something obvious before I go down either of those paths. And then, I don't know, man. It's kind of a toss-up. I think I'm most curious, though, about the coffin. Because that feels like the most likely to go to a whole new place. Okay, so I think the item I'm looking for... Is it just that? Because that doesn't look like it would be hard to get to. It just looks like a walk up a thing and then drop. Am I crazy? Did I just... Can you not reach that on your horse? Surely you can, right? Oh, whoa. Okay, you can, but it's janky as fuck because it's a horse. All right. I think maybe I just hadn't realized you could ride your horse in here yet. Okay. That was simple. Pretty nice vantage point. Anything else I'm missing here? Can I go onto that at all? I think that might be too steep. That certainly looks... oh. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There's an ant up there. So that does certainly appear to be... yeah, there's ants up there too. Yeah, those are places I can go. Are they places I can go from here? Ooh, ouch. And is that something I can find out?
pretty hard to say. That might be a bit steep for me. I want to get onto that. I don't think I can do that from here. Uh, I think even that, which I can get on, right? That one, I can get on. I don't think that connects. It's kind of hard to tell. The browns a little bit blend together. Ooh, is this some sneaky way up? That's the one I was looking at before. It does not connect to what's above me, which is what I want to get on. It does not look like there's a way for me to hop up there from here. I might actually be able to, whoa. Might be able to walk pretty far up here, maybe? Oh, no, not at all. Okay, I'm gonna have to assume that that is somewhere I could get to later. Um, hmm, but I'll also just have to Keep it in mind. Um, I actually, even though I'm more curious about the casket, I am actually going to go here first. And the reason is, I think that this is more likely to be leading to a dead end of sorts. Ooh, but... I'm sorry, I'm kind of wasting a lot of time here on a whole lot of nothing, but I'm also very tempted to see if Fia has anything to say. Or maybe even this guy, because he was friends with... Oh, hello there. What can I do for you? What is he holding, by the way? He's got a weird situation. His armor seems to have a second guy with its own set of arms. Is that tinkling talking sound just the sight of grace? I think so. Pleased to see you again. Would you like me to hold you once more? Now, come closer. You are so very warm. was known as a deathbed companion where I come from after I received the warmth and lively vigor 
from a number of champions, I lay with the remains of an exalted noble to grant him another chance at life. To do so is the purpose of my being. But before I could bear the noble into new life, I was awakened by the guidance of grace and chased from my birthplace. Pray, be kind. Despite all that, I still wish to be a deathbed companion. So please, let me hold you like this, as often as it takes. My dear, have you ever heard of Black Knife Prince? Dear Roger likes to talk of them when abed, and the ancient plot in which the first of the demigods was slain. Okay. The Black Knives wielded by the assassins who committed the act, along with the impressions they made, somehow hide the truth of the conspiracy. These grand affairs are hardly my fault. Somehow, indeed, this is but so vague. Dear Roger began to weep as he spoke. In truth, I've heard tell from someone else about the Black Knife Prince that fascinate dear Roger so. Hmm. I was supposed to do this way but earlier, it wasn't be I? Right to give this to him. Why is it stuck as he is in the round table hole? Perhaps you could make use of it. It wouldn't be right. It was it was capitalized? That's weird. I didn't get to ask her a favor. I am pleased. Would you like me? The blessing is still a flame in your breath. Would you like to be held? Now. Did I miss dialogue? You are so. My dear, might I ask something of you? Could you please find the owner of this dagger and return it to them? A certain person gave it to me as a gift. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place in the owner's heart. So I would like for the original owner to have it back, if you wouldn't mind. I'd like you to find the owner of it's a very precious then good day to you my dear I get the feeling that I was supposed to do that uh, while Roger was still alive but I didn't understand what she was or what she was doing and I still don't so I didn't do anything of the sort A simple map given by Fia, a clue to the whereabouts of a black knife print. I think I might know exactly where that is. And I may have already gotten it. Yeah, I believe I already got this. Okay. I suppose it's probably a key item. Yeah. I was hoping it was an actual weapon. Dagger received from Fia, the deathbed companion. She wishes for it to be returned to its rightful owner. It was once a special weapon of gold and silver intertwined, but is now worn down and marred by a black gash. Well, gold and silver intertwined sounds to me like D, who is, I believe, related to her quest. Or not to her quest, but to her whole deal, seeing as he, well, he hunts those who lives in death and he's friends with Roger. something else? Well, what have we here? 
How did you get your hands on that dagger? Is he huffing it? Well, that hardly matters. I know very well whose dagger it is. Why don't I return it to them for you? Good work bringing this to me. Oh, well, whose is it? Did you need? Mm, that's not very satisfying. Was it Rogier's that I fucked up? I am pleased. Would you like me? The blessing is. Would you like to? Now. You are so. Dear Roger, like the ancient plot, the Black Knight, along with. Then good day to you, my dear. Well, I think I fucked up. My instinct is that I fucked up. Greetings, are you here for spirit? I think I fucked up is because I think that uh, since I already had the knife print way before she told me about it um, I think because uh, correct me if I'm wrong but um, the spot on her map is here yeah definitely um, um she should have had different dialogue, wouldn't you think, uh, since I already had it? Uh, but she didn't. And since the only per other person that she seems to mention among all of that is um, Roger, I bet that I was supposed to do something for Roger with that black knife print before he died. Um, but I failed to do that. Or who knows, maybe he'll show up alive somewhere else. But I've seen him die twice now, so. Well, technically many times. <laughs> I'm going here just because uh, the Black Knife Catacombs reminded me of this converted rise. I had a distant thought of another way to interpret its instructions. Which was to look up. But I don't say... May erudition not guide the way, though. It's light the way. May erudition light the way. Never mind. Maybe I have zero clue whatsoever. What the hell? Oh, this place is infuriating. Okay. Mm. Well, I hope I didn't miss a ton by not paying any attention to Fia whatsoever. 
but I kind of feel like maybe I did. Um, I just really didn't understand what her deal was. And I was afraid of her. Maybe that was wrong of me. Um, bring the music back just in case anything fun happens. Here goes nothing. With 20 minutes left. Sorry, I did a, I spent a half hour doing zero. gotta come up with something more interesting for these long as loading screens like honestly i want the loading screens in bloodborne and dark souls to be longer sometimes so i can read more item descriptions i don't know why they took item descriptions away from the loading screens of the game with the longest loading screens and the most items you know Lainel, the royal capital. It's not really where I want to be right now. This looks like a whole ding dang place. Jeez. Usually speaking, this is pretty stirring. The dark green overgrown and then through it this bright chaos. It split down the middle like it was struck by lightning. That's a really pretty little corridor. That goes down a ways. So is that the first god who died, then? Godwin? Godfrey? I don't remember which one. My utmost thanks for bringing me to the base of the Erd Tree. Uh-oh. Here. I can govern my own movement. You're evil, aren't you? Thus, Holy shit, box here. Is fulfilled. I shall depart to ascertain the purpose I was given. Farewell. I shall leave Torrent and the power to turn runes into strength. Here, with you, I wish you luck in realizing your ambition. You have fought long and hard. I have no doubt you will become Elden Lord. May you take the throne. Something tells me that she's got some wicked goals. Um, hey, Bok. Bok the Seamster, at your service, my lord. Ready to make adjustments to your garments. My lord. Did you see it? The... the Erd Tree? I... Oh, I don't really have the words for this. I mean... I was so... 
you've so seen it dazzled, before, right? It's kind of hard to miss wherever you are. The Erd tree is waiting for you, my lord. I know it, I do. I feel it in my bones. Oh, please, take the throne of Elden Lord. I don't know if I'm really a throne type. My lord, have you ever wished you might be born again? Oh. Well, they say that Ranala of Rhea Lucaria has the power to help people be reborn. Oh. Me? Reborn? Oh, look at me. When you're this ugly, well, being reborn, it would hardly make a difference, I'm afraid. <laughs> I'd rather look like you. If I could be reborn and look like you, I would do it. My lord, what's this? Oh. <gasps> oh, it can't be. From my rebirth. But these are precious. Are you certain that it's for me? Oh. oh, my lord. How did you know? Know what? I don't know a thing. It was my only wish that I might honor oh, you with man. a decent appearance. Appearance? It's not supposed to change your appearance. My lord, it shouldn't take me long. I'm off to see Renala of Rhea Lucaria. Is he going to turn into a human? Born fresh and new. But he already said that it wouldn't make much difference. You're less of a seamster and more of a cape remover. Just a really good cape remover. Not too useful to a, somebody who kind of likes capes. Hmm, what's the difference here? I see no difference in that one. My lord, I'm off. To I'll be reborn. I'm going already, my lord. Please do be safe on your journeys. Should I expect to find him here? Should I reload this area? Everybody that I give a damn about ends up here and not in a good shape. Altered beyond repair to some sort of hideous new appearance. Now, I don't really like Bach too much. He kind of annoys me, actually. I find him to be a bit of a, bit of a groveling wimp. But, um, but I still feel like I'd prefer him as a gremlin than as whatever the hell this is. Good lord, she's ruined you. Terrifying. I thought you were a seamster. You had clothes before. Why do you have less clothes as a human? Oh my god, and you can't even talk anymore? You're just like a hideous, grotesque wimp. Wow, see... How can you not distrust Renala? She ruins people. What? Oh, fuck. You bitch. 
Art thou now assured? Be not alarmed, nor afeard. I don't, I don't I like you at all. So, I think Box just dead now. See, this room is just like a pile of fates worse than death. Uh, my eye. Fucking miserable, man. If he was going to become human, why not just let him become human? And then he could have, like, been the leader at Kenneth's place. I, this whole time, thought that surely Bach was going to be redeemed by being the demi-human, like, hero that Kenneth Height wanted. Because Kenneth Height wanted to make peace with the demi-humans, did he not? And he also wanted a hero? Is that the Lance of Longinus? I thought Bach was the perfect candidate. But what can I do if Kenneth never takes me up on that idea? Are you playing that note? You're an adorable guy. Wow, you might be my favorite design in the game. That is my jam right there. I love long-limbed blue things. Okay. Oh, I love the sound you make when you die, too. I love the way you move with the little spins! Oh god, please let there be a spirit of whatever the hell you are. Ooh, big one. Awesome. I love these things. Some good money. Something was chasing me from behind, wasn't it? Oh, hey, that's one of you. Oh.
this is an incredible environment. This is such an incredible environment. Wow. The capital's actually cool? You're kidding me. My money was not on the capital being cool. Smithing stone four. Okay. Oh, to have a study like this. I think I made this place an Animal Crossing once. Tiled roofs are pretty cool. Mostly worn off. I like whatever your weird magic is. I want to be and do everything about you. I want to dress like you. I want to summon you as spirits. I want to have your weapons. to have your spells. Kind of feels like I was supposed to get here a little earlier. Anyways, uh, this definitely seems like the less of a dead end route. Let's just backtrack for a moment. And see if this is equally not at all a dead end. Capital outskirts. A place I've been. Yeah, it's a bottomless pit. Okay. a boss fight. Yeah, not feeling like that at the moment. At all. Is this anywhere I recognize? Not really. Well, I'm going to end this here and uh, come back here later. At the beginning of the next episode, I believe I will be back in the Deep Root Depths because I want to check out that casket before I do all of this. Bye for now.